You guys, I haven't been doing as many tool review videos because they don't perform as well as the service videos, but I do like the thermal imaging camera ones. So um, I've had a lot of, lot of companies uh, contact me to review their thermal imaging cameras. And, uh, and this is one here that's pretty neat. Uh, it's the Mile C1 uh, TP2 and it connects right to your phone via Bluetooth. And, uh, and yeah, I told him I'd check it out for him. So, uh, so here that is, we're gonna carry it along with us on a, on a couple service calls here. We'll check it out. Yeah guys, so here it is, the TP2. We're gonna get it opened up and I'm gonna show you the icon for the app you need, which is right here. A um, little bit confusing in the directions about it, but that is the app you need right there. Um, so make sure you go download that, open it up. And then you'll get to this screen here. Now, uh, I'm just looking at the device here. But one thing I want to mention, um, for some reason, I have to turn off my cellular data to make it work. I'm not sure why that is. But I have to turn off cellular your data. And also, you need Bluetooth on and Wi-Fi on because it actually connects with Bluetooth. But it also omits a Wi-Fi signal to connect uh, to the device. So... You want to make sure you have uh, your Wi-Fi on, Bluetooth on, and for me, it might be one of my settings. I don't know. You need to have cellular cellular data off. Um, so yeah, this unit right here actually has a bag condenser fan motor, so that's why everything is so warm right now. But you can see it's 156 degrees inside there. We know that's way too warm, and this is a Lennox um, communicating system here. It's got this big fancy board in it. And you can see how warm that is also right now. And it's pretty warm outside, too. I think it's about 100 degrees outside right now. And uh, you can see that by, you know, looking at Kenny right there. He's um, actually cooler than the outdoor temperatures. So you don't see that very often. But we're just looking at some registers here. This system is not running. So that's why we're not getting any cool air from that register. But looking around this home right here, we can see uh, some of the warm points. This is like a wax warmer type deal. And then, um, and some other stuff there. Yeah, just checking out some other stuff in this home. Um, you know, it's a, it's a pretty neat camera. You can see some heat intrusion here. But uh, this right here I wanted to show you guys. I actually did a screen recording here. So I can just show you some of the options here. Uh, show you that you can turn these... Uh, crosshairs on and off the center hot point and uh, cool point you can turn all that on and off and um, we can go through some of the options here of infrared mode visible light mode um, uh, we got a picture in picture mode and stuff like that so uh, pretty pretty easy to navigate all this and um, yeah we can uh, we can actually make adjustments we can make all kinds of adjustments here um, I can try to explain it to you, but it's better off kind of just um, just hopping in it yourself and, um, and and getting into it. But yeah, we have all these different modes here. We have uh, white hot, black hot. Um, we have a rainbow mode, uh, an iron mode, which is really what I usually stay in the most is the iron mode. But yeah, all kinds of different other modes here also. Getting into some of these other adjustments, you can adjust the um, the distance away from the target you want to uh, measure. That's one you really want to keep an eye on because you will get different readings from the different um, distances you are away. So make sure you set that properly or you might get a false reading. All right, one more thing I wanted to show you guys is this this point to point measurement. So we basically just draw a line from point to point on the screen and it gives us our uh, the, the temperature of that area. And you can also do it with, um, with these dots here. So you put a dot on the screen, it will hold the temperature of where that dot is hitting. And you can put up to, I believe, three dots on the screen. So if you wanted to measure three separate points Actually, um, it's more than that because you still have your hot point, cold point, and center point. But you can set up three separate areas to keep the temperature of at all times there. So 
that's a very neat option there also. Like I said, I haven't even begun to scratch the surface here of all this, uh, of all the options here, but it gets into quite a bit of them. All right, guys, that is the Miles C TP2 Plus thermal imaging camera. So if you want one of these, it's about $400. Uh, if you use the link down in the, in the description box, um, I get a commission and you'll save some money also. So I'm also going to be giving this away. If you want to win it, like, comment, share the video on Saturday. I believe it'll be around Saturday Saturday or Sunday. I'm going to pick a winner. So it'll, this, this video will stay up. I'm going to be picking a comment. I think I'll randomly pick it while using the random comment generator so make sure you comment only comment once though and um, i'll pick somebody you'll win it i'll get your address you'll email me with your address and i'll send it to you four hundred dollar value here guys so make sure you comment um, like and share to enter to win but yeah i mean it's a solid thermal camera i like it um i like that you can uh, you can snap it right to your phone if you want to that's what these little guys are here like I said, this, uh, these are retractable here. They'll snap right to your phone and um, still connect by, by Bluetooth, though. So, all right, guys, that's going to be it for this one. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Check out Milesy. I'm going to put all their, um, their social media uh, links down in the description. Also, a lot of cool stuff by them. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Yeah, guys, by the way, I haven't done a giveaway in a while, so don't try to scam me. Don't try to scam each other. And anybody out there watching, don't try to scam my viewers. You will get banned immediately and turned over to the YouTube police. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, if you win it, it's going to be someone inside the United States. If you're outside the United States, I'm sorry. And um, I will be sending you the camera. I'm not going to be sending you a PayPal um, a transaction or itunes gift card or anything crazy like that you will get the camera and that's it and it's a 400 dollars value so it's a very very nice giveaway guys so just wanted to say that don't try to scam me don't try to scam each other keep it civil we'll get somebody a lucky winner of this camera